of meth. It's just it is really crazy. All right, here we go. So uh, this is my friend and patient H H, and Mrs H said, you know, this procedure that you just had was like is is like having a cataract. It's a life changer. Yeah, so absolutely. Mr H had two superior interspinous spacers placed. And before you had a place, what was life like? How was walking? I couldn't you? walk. I mean, I could walk. I had a. I would walk, but I couldn't walk. Okay. I couldn't walk a hundred yards. I couldn't walk fifty yards without stopping. Now I'd stop, rest, and then I walk again. And then, now so I so, how long is maybe a hundred yards you could go? I didn't, couldn't no, even couldn't do that. that far. Like to the elevator, you were like saying. Twenty-five feet. Twenty-five feet. And then you have to stop. And so. We put these in, we put the spacers in, we put in two uh, last Wednesday. Yes. And so, what was your experience? Oh, and they'll know who you are. That we had a Come wardrobe on. failure. I think we're going to be okay. Uh, so, but after the procedure, how did you feel? Or how did you feel during the procedure? Well, it's kind of fun. <laughs> We were talking at an Because you were awake the whole time. I wasn't, yeah, yeah. I wasn't quite good going. I, I wasn't awake. Look at this thing. I'll pull it down just a hair. We were, yeah. we were uh, uh, the, the Fiji was fine. It was yeah. really, I said, it was very interesting. Yeah, I and was awake. And you I, were yeah. hanging on it. It looked like a food tenderizer mallet. I like, didn't see it, but it felt like it. It was about like that. And then... Did it hurt during the procedure? No. Okay, um, good, good. As I said, it was interesting. It was kind of fun to. We were talking away, if you remember. Yeah. yeah it, was, it was really. And so when you went home that night, how did you feel? Um, it's hard to tell because I just went to sleep. I but would say I was waiting out in the car thinking he'd be carried out in a wheelchair. And I'm looking for the wheelchair. All of a sudden, he's walking around the car, walking in the car. He was walking. He was just standing up so straight. He'd been all bent over. I could have, I could hardly believe it was him. Really, that was and right that, after the surgery. Wow. Two was, days later, I, I took a little walk, which was to the elevator to CVS, and it was amazing. It was different. It was yeah. different. And, uh, very different than before. In and, what way? Different. I didn't have the pain. I did yeah. not have the. I would get. I would start to walk. I would get back spasms. Yes. And then I get short of breath. Okay. And then I have to sit down. And you'd have. Would you have leg pain or tiredness? I had leg pain. I had tiredness. I had pain shooting down both legs. And. You know, today I just walked in here. Then it occurred to me I'm just walking in here. Without pain. Yeah. Dramatic. I mean, I don't know. It's one of those things. It's like so satisfying to do this procedure for me. Oh. And I, I always wait in anticipation of the follow up because I know <laughs> that's gonna be. You know. It was really. It's really a life changer. Yeah. I mean, he's sleeping in the bed. He slept. You yeah. know, he was sleeping in a chair. He couldn't lay in the bed. Couldn't lie down. Yeah. Sleeping on his back all night. Down. No more snoring. No more. I mean, wow, it's good for everything. It good. is. Well, yeah. <laughs> Can you play the piano now? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and he, the he, violin. Oh, right. But he lost a lot of weight too, which helped. Yes. Yes. We well, any any concerns or or um, suggestions you might have for another patient who has really what it's called is neurogenic claudication, which is pain in the buttock and legs when you walk, relieved when you sit. If you have that story then almost universally this procedure works. Well, it worked for me. Yeah. And I, it's getting better every day and I'm trying not to push it. Yeah. Well, you know, in time, I think your walking distance will really improve when the, the legs get to wake up and get, because they haven't been used much. No, you know? they have not been used yeah. much. Yeah. We got interrupted by a phone call. <laughs> so, <laughs> sorry. No, I would, I would recommend this highly. I'm, Deconditioned because I've been sitting around for so yes. long. If I wasn't, I don't think the back spasms would stop me from walking at all. Yeah. Other things stop me from walking because I get too tired because I uh, 
haven't done anything for so long. Has your tiredness improved? Uh, actually it has, but it's, there's a lot of things that go into it. I haven't real. I used to exercise all the time. I used to walk miles and miles. And now, then I stopped. Then I figured out a way to exist. Right, without, resting and yeah, going more. Yeah, but now I can see that I'll be able to get back to, uh, to my actual existence. Yeah. Well, I can see bad golf in my future. <laughs> what is better than that? Uh, not much, actually. That's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it is. Well, so I'll see you next week, yes. and uh, we'll see how things are going at that point. And uh, I appreciate it. Do you mind if I put this on YouTube? No, I don't know. Awesome. As long as I don't look good. No, 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 I'm <laughs> fine. Right on. Maybe it'll go viral. We'll oh, I'm sure it will. <laughs> I'm sure it will. We'll become stars. Oh, for sure. Absolutely. <laughs> okay, now we're right. All right. Thank you. Thank I appreciate you. so much. Oh, oh my pleasure. My pleasure. It's my pleasure.